Okay, here's a quick video to explain the difference between normal left hand or piano left hand and having the accompaniment on. So this is what um, you would normally get when you turn the keyboard on is this kind of sound down the bottom. Um, and you can add a beat to that if you want to. So if you start a pop beat here and we can play as we normally would. If you take a look at your keyboard, you might have a button that says something like accompaniment on, um, which I'm going to press now. Or it might be, if you've got a Yamaha keyboard, it might say single finger chord. Or if you've got a Casio keyboard, it might say Casio chord. And if you press that, then we have this sound. And what the keyboard is doing for you there is it's actually playing three notes for you when you only play one. So when I play this C chord here, what it's actually playing for you is something like this. Or if I play this G note here, it's actually playing something like this. So it's a bit of a cheap way of getting more sound from your left hand, which is nice. Now if we get the beat going with this, you'll see that the keyboard adds a whole extra load of parts for you from all sorts of different instruments and it will hold that chord for you, even if you let go, until you play the next one, like this. So it can be a bit confusing because it sounds um, like you're not doing anything because you can't hear yourself playing those keys but what you're actually doing is you're changing the sound that's coming out of the speakers at you um, and you're changing what all the extra instruments in your band are playing for you. So um, this is how it works.